Hey guys, this is Soup here, and today I'm bringing you what I believe is the first tutorial on my channel. Now, I don't know if this is an original idea, but I know I have never seen anything like this. Uh, this is basically a redstone clock that can be used in place of the usual. Now, this may be useful, uh, if you want to do something that actually takes advantage of moving the spider somewhere, but it can also be used um, as an alternative to the normal because I know sometimes with Optifine, clocks can do odd things and the game doesn't run as well as it should, or sometimes I think holes appear in the world while using a clock. Um, so I will show you how to build this. And then I will explain a few things about it. F to build the spider clock, um, what you must have is soul sand, uh, a block, preferably glass. Uh, it makes it a little easier to see what's going on. Um, some kind of half slabs, some type of pressure plate, sticky pistons, and redstone. To start off, just dig a formation like this in the ground, place down your redstone, and place two sticky pistons like so, and place your soul sand block on top of the redstone. From here you can place your half slabs on top of the pistons and your pressure plate. And you'll notice that if you stand on this, it'll act the same way it does when the spider is on it. And the slime okay probably will get in the way. Um, what you do next is you only need to build something that looks like this. Now you have to leave, oh you actually have to leave a gap this large. Um, I think you might be able to get away with one block smaller but I've just built it this way. So it should look like this from the top and then you simply put another layer across there but now you can close it on this other part and then just cover it up and that is it in its entirety and you could have your output coming anywhere from the soul sand block <clears throat> alright I have spawned a spider in here and as you can see it's working fine now using an egg, it may climb around, you just bump him from the corner, and he will, or he or she, I guess, will be in the proper place to put this. Um, in building one of these in survival mode, there may be some problems trying to get the spider oriented correctly, and then to capture it. But you probably could do it. Now, as you just saw right there, occasionally, there will be, um a time where the spider manages to fall slightly faster and it's usually yeah right there oh and that time it actually it actually did a glitch there uh, which I'll talk about in a second but as you can see sometimes the spider will jump up and come down which will cause the timer to fluctuate and go about twice as fast for just the, those two repetitions and this does not happen very this is probably the rarest of the three things that happen to this this is where the spider has managed to be inside the half slabs because half slabs aren't like uh, f full solid blocks I think is how you classify that all I have to do is just like hit it or push them a little but even weirder and this is a glitch that doesn't have to do with the system as much Sometimes the pistons will not pull back down if the pressure plate can be reactivated faster than it retracts, which sounds really weird, but it can cause it to just act like normal pistons for that one repetition and just leave this up here. And of course that makes it so the spider is now sitting on top of these half slabs instead of on the pressure plate like it needs to be. Um, 
And once again, I don't know if this is my original idea. I just know I've personally never seen it done before. And I think it has its uses, especially, like I said, if you're using Optifine and the glitch where world holes will occur happens to you, this may be a better way to have a timer. And, uh, I don't, there's, there's probably a lot of uses that you guys could think of, um, if you ever just wanted to try something different. I know just doing the same old redstone stuff can get boring. So that is it for this tutorial, guys. I will see you next time. Fucking slides! Ugh.